Commonwealth Games chairman Peter Beattie has hit out at the Wingers, who have lined up to slam the event in the wake of the closing ceremony debacle. Appearing on Sky News, the former Queensland Labour Premier said the Ferrari surrounding Sunday night's closing ceremony had gone too far. Mr Beattie was forced to apologise on Monday after the host broadcaster missed out showing the athletes enter Carrara Stadium for the last time. Peter Beattie and fellow former Queensland Premier Campbell Newman discussed the Commonwealth Games closing ceremony on Sky News. Supplied, the now ARL chairman said he was embarrassed over the mishap but took full responsibility because the buck stops with me, talking on his regular slot on Sky News, Mr Beattie took aim at the self-indulgent commentators but appeared to be speaking to Australians in general, I just think one of the problems is that we are getting to a stage of being a pack of whingers, he said, I just say to Australia we're bigger than this, we should be about positive things, about building things, about doing things and we shouldn't try to tear down people who won't do that. The Commonwealth Games closing ceremony was slammed by pundits and punters alike. AAP Often some of the commentators who are very self-indulgent forget this, there is a very good team at GOLDOC, which is the organizing committee, and whenever you get sort of beat-ups and so on the morale of those wonderful individuals actually is affected, I work with these people, they're non-political, they worked incredibly hard, and delivered one of the best Commonwealth Games Australia's ever had, it's the people who build that create great nations and frankly unless we stop whinging we're going to go down a long gurgler and it's not going to be very good, he said. On Monday, Mr Beattie said the athletes were not shown walking into the stadium over concerns for their welfare. Usain Bolt and Boro B the koala weren't enough to keep games fans happy. AAP, in the end, we can go through the entrails of all this but I'm chairman and the bucks tops with me. I accept full responsibility for it, he said, it was driven by the right reasons and concerns about the welfare of athletes but they should have been involved, there were too many speeches, I shouldn't have spoken because it bored the athletes silly. One less speech from me would have helped, presenters for the Seven Network, the Australian television rights holders for the Games, ravaged the Games organisers because the broadcast vision they provided did not include the athletes entering the stadium, Games organisers, made the decision not to have the athletes enter the stadium. They made the decision not to show the flag bearers, Seven host Johanna Grigg said, I'm furious. They're actually wrecking a tradition. There are no athletes here and I've never seen a stadium so empty halfway through a ceremony, copyright 9 Digital Tie Limited 2018.